Okay, once you have the exhaust manifold off, now you're going to want to deal with the belts. Exhaust manifold is off. All the belts are still intact. What you want to do first is you got to take the air intake off. And the reason why, it's got to come off anyways, but right now is a good time because you got to access the mounting bolts for the uh, AC compressor to help get the belt off. So right now, I've already loosened it up, and basically it's just three clamps, one, two, three, uh, should be a, a flathead, and then there's a 10 millimeter here, and a very popular connection in these 240s is sort of like this. You're going to find it throughout injectors and this and that. Basically, there's a little metal tab here. You push that in and then you get the, to get it out. Okay, so so basically, I've already loosened it up, so I'm going to pull it out real quick. Get, take a 10 millimeter out first. You can move the airflow sensor back. And then take that L out, and then the mass airflow sensor, and all the clamps. Okay, so basically, now that that's missing, now you can get at these bolts. And there's another mounting bolt, I think that's a 14, maybe there's one here, and there's one back here. Okay, and then you take a 10 millimeter on this, you go back, and it gives you the mobility to flex. Same thing here. You take this mounting bolt and you unloosen it and it, you're able to adjust the tension on the belt. This is how you adjust the tension on the belt. We'll get to that later. You go lefty, left, left, left and it gives you the mobility back and forth. You're able to take the belts off. Now if you remember there was um, I'm sorry. There was this pulley here. Now when we took the fan off that simply just comes out with the belts. Mark the belts, remember which ones go which, and if there are any belts that are bad, obviously you're going to want to replace those.